previously on Torment. This is my home, like it or not, and has been for thousands of years. Is there truly a way out? Is this a chance for escape? I must seize it! Nothing can be worse than this place. I don't think I've ever seen anything as beautiful as what I'm looking at right now. I may not remember much about my past, but I will remember this view for the whole of eternity. So there are others like me. The elves live! <laughs> there are none like you. Go, call upon the elves. Spread your corruption to them. If they don't kill you on the site, that is. He took us away. He tortured us. He turned many into those foul orcs. He will not turn me. <sighs> well, it's morning, and I have spent yet another night in a stranger's house. But it turns out this stranger is pretty cool. His name is Braga, and he initially wanted me to collect three bronze throwing axes in order to spend the night in his house. But I made him another deal because I don't really think I have the expertise to do that. I installed a free furnace for him. <laughs> and I think he's happy with it because I want to cook my raw venison. Two birds with one stone and now he's left. I wanted to talk to him again, but he also did tell me a little bit about the world around us. I am in the Angmar Mountains right now. And by going south, I am actually doing the right thing because he tells me that will take me into Angmar proper. And although he's a simple man and he doesn't know too much about the world around, he does think that there will be people and or Oryx in Angmar that will be able to tell me more about what I want to know. And uh, that's really about it. I spent the night getting myself a little bit organized, talking to him. Uh, he doesn't mind me taking his three pouches, which I have now converted into a food pouch, a resources pouch, and a stuff pouch. I don't have a lot of anything. But, uh, you know, it will help me keep my inventory a little bit clear. Let's put them up here. Just clear out a little bit of space. It is also raining outside, but he did tell me that this is south. So I'm not going to need the sun for now. These things done? All right. Oh, dear. Oh, dear is right, because I hear a ton of trolls outside. Oh, God, there's one already. Okay. Uh, this could be a problem. All right, let's go. Sorry, I left your door open. We're going to try and run into this other house here. Is the entrance? Yes, it's here. Okay, we're inside. I want to see what they got in here. They got anything I can... Oh, what is that? Keen Smith Scroll. Plus one melee damage. I don't know what that does or what it is, but hey, I'm going to take it. A mug. Maybe I can use that for something? <laughs> I definitely could use a drink, that's for sure. Hi. Ah! All right, run, run, run and climb. Hopefully I can climb faster than him. Ugh. Another piece of information that I did learn as well is that the skies are like this because many of the creatures here, oh, okay, many of the creatures, like whatever just hit me there. Ah, two-headed troll. Many of the creatures uh, do not like sunlight. They thrive in darkness. They are creatures of darkness and therefore the skies have been turned dark in order to keep them at their full power, at their full potential, which is horrible for me. Although, I don't know. Maybe I'm a creature of darkness myself. Maybe it's helping me in some way. But I don't know yet. Uh, nothing good so far. All I see are trolls. I'm going to have to be very careful about my directions here. I don't have any way to tell direction except for my memory, which, let's face it, is fairly shot. I see another what looks like one of those little farms up here. I'm going to raid it quickly. Get myself a little more wheat. See if there's anything else around. Oh, hi. Oh. Wait a minute. Do you... I don't yet trust filthy <laughs> elves like you. Beat it, scum! Well... I mean, what, what do I? What can I say to that? <laughs> I, I agree with you in some ways. Never trust the elves. <clears throat> We're still definitely in the mountains, as you can as you can tell <laughs> by the fact that I'm surrounded by stupid mountains. There are a lot less sort of passes and valleys in these mountains as well. They're just—I mean, you just gotta climb them. 
There's no way around it anymore. There's no way for me to pretend like I'm not in the mountains. And every time I get past a set of mountains, all I see are more mountains. And then, often the very easiest ways to traverse are, yes, guarded by monsters who want to kill me. Here's the thing. I am nervous. I want to defend myself. I want to be able to protect myself and defend myself. But I'm really worried about that if I anger one of them, I may anger them all. And that would be bad. I need to be able to pass through these lands at least somewhat unmolested. And as long as the trolls... Oh, I should definitely eat. There we go. As long as the trolls, um, you know, don't really seriously try to kill me, then I'm generally okay. If the Oryx are angry, then I'm in trouble. Because there are so many more of them, and they're so much more dangerous. I was really hoping to find something in the way of civilization. More houses, more, more people to actually talk to, to interact with, but I am not seeing anything. There's a whole lot of mountains, and guys who want to kill me, generally. And the Oryx, who mostly ignore me. Hey! Alright! Things have changed. And it looks like I'm still headed in the right direction. Good, good, good. Alright. My furs are very wet, but they should dry out a little bit as I warm up slightly. Hey, those are flowers. Okay. I see flowers. Oh my goodness. We are taking these. I never expected to see flowers here. What are they? A thistle. Well, <laughs> I used the word flower loosely there, but wow, that's that's pretty incredible. Guy probably does not want to trade with me. They don't trust me, and I understand. Because I am stealing all their wheat. <laughs> here, I'll leave two for you. There you go. More what looks like flowers here. What are these? Flax. I will take this. I don't know what it is, but it looks interesting. Thistle and flax. A couple of interesting plants that I have discovered. I don't really know their use, but... They're beautiful. They make me feel a little bit better. So, they've already become useful to me. <laughs> See another farm here. I have found a whole bunch of these farms. I'm also getting very, very hungry. Let's... Let's stop and eat for a second here. But yeah, I've collected quite a bit of wheat now. Ugh. Okay, we're down to one meat. I'm gonna have to make some bread soon, but I'm hoping that I'll be able to stop for the night somewhere and not have to sleep out in the open. Come on, I haven't found a single dwelling of any kind since I left that hillman's house. And I'm really hoping that I can. The orc battle going over there, and one of these weird structures. I think I will leave them alone. Oh! Hello! They're so cute! They're like... mini wargs! <laughs> I- Oh, the sun is going down. Oh goodness, the sun is going down. Oh, wow. I feel like I want to make friends with you guys. Can I have a pet whatever you are? Huh. Well, let's keep going for now. It's getting dark. Very quickly, in fact. Oh. You scared the crap out of me and... Where? Where? Okay, there are a lot. This... Okay, they're okay. We have found a giant... What looks like a village of some kind. This plane. Have I... Have I reached... Have I left the mountains behind? Maybe I have. Maybe I have. Okay, that that is a very good thing if I have. Oh, no, maybe not a good thing. Let's go over here to one of these houses. There are a lot of houses here. We'll check them out. And we'll spend the night here. Hopefully no one minds. There are quite a few houses. Huh. Looks like we found ourselves a little village or something. Hello. Miss. Hello. 
Rangers are no match for the strength of the Hillmen of Rundar. Uh, well, I've yet to meet the Rangers. Maybe you can tell me a little bit more about them. You... I'm kind of cute. Okay, we found another pouch. Awesome. Some sticks. An axe. A pole axe. <laughs> okay. I'll take all of this stuff. Why not? In fact... Wow, oh, you've already left. Nobody seems to care. More pouches. An apple. One stone sword. Okay, we are finding a ton of stuff. Hi, did I just talk to you? I have tasted the blood of Westermen many a time, and I shall again. I am not a Westerman, all right? And you're about to let your hair on fire. So be careful there, lady. Okay, we're going to check out these last two houses, three houses. I have struck it lucky yet again. Why is there a chest sitting right there? What is this? Compass. What exactly is that? A Linden long spear that looks very, very damaged. War scythe. There is so much stuff here. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna take. E Ooh. I'm gonna take everything right now. Everything. And I'm gonna sort through it before bed. How's that sound? More venison, potato, th uh, throwing axe. I'll take the mugs because I don't know why. I have. This is definitely something different. What is this structure? Let's save that one for last. The moon is already high in the sky. Two iron. Herbal's Guide to Slashing and Smashing. Ooh. All right, I found a book. Huh. Okay, it is getting a little bit scary out here. Let's go into this place. Do I see more houses over there? No. Let's go into this place. Oh, this is a fancy one. Looks like fire down there. What is this? Okay, Amar. Another pickaxe. More venison. Arrows I'll take. Angmar pickaxe. You know, I definitely should probably take these if possible because hold on a sec. We are we are getting way ahead of ourselves. Alright, I'm gonna spend the night in this house because I like it. <laughs> so let's take a minute first and close the door. And let's take a minute here. I think I can do this. Can I not? I can! Combine a pouch. Now, resources is already getting full. Can I combine this again and make it bigger? I can! All right, we have made ourselves a large pouch. We have three medium pouches. We are doing good. All right, I think we finally got things organized. We got our food pouch here. We got resources, which is now large. We got equipment and we got stuff. I've mostly sorted all this stuff out. I kept my weed out because I'm going to use this right now to make some bread. Whoops. I'm going to use this right now, maybe, to make some bread. Boom. 14 bread. Look at that. All right. So I think it's time for me to go to bed. I have gotten myself pretty much prepared here. And I hopefully will spend the night in comfort. He does not seem angry at me at all in any way. And in the morning, I guess we set out. We have had a very, very successful trip so far. I've gotten quite a bit further south. Looks like I've left the mountains behind. At least I'm hoping that. Anyway, it is time for me to go to bed. Oh, that was a weird little flash of something. I don't know what that was. I was back in Utumno for a second. Oh, well, anyway. We keep on going. What makes you think you can lead my warriors to battle, elf? I'm not going to lead your warriors, but thank you very much for your hospitality, and I will be on my way. Hopefully you don't notice that every single one of your chests are now empty. Okay. All right. Um, okay. Nope. Let's run. Let's run. I was thinking about creating armor, but you know what? Let's keep going. <laughs> let's definitely just keep on going. So we're going to leave this little village behind us. Uh, actually, I didn't check out that orc camp over there. Let me do that quickly as well. And then we'll be on our way. A water skin. Huh. It reminds me, I don't think I've had a drink in a while. Bones. We'll pass on the bones for now. This is much, much better for me. As far as being able to see trolls and enemies for a distance. So I should be a lot safer here. 
I got this has got to be Angmar now. I must have left the mountains behind. In fact, you can see them in the distance there. I think we're headed in the right direction. Hopefully someone here can tell me a little bit more. And I forgot to actually ask those villagers about Angmar, but hopefully we find another village. I mean, if I found one this quickly, it would make sense there's a lot more villages out here. Flatter areas, easier to build. Uh, well, I'm seeing what looks like more mountains here. Oh, I really am. Am I out of the mountains yet? I'm not sure. What is that? What is that? We are going to check that out. That giant structure there. I don't know what it is, but I want to take a look. Let's be careful when we go in. Because I see a troll there. Doesn't look like there's much in the way of anything to get. Looks just empty. Anything here? No. Doesn't look like it. Maybe I can get a good view of the land around and see if there's anything else, though. Anything up here? Whoa! You scared me. Come back when you've proven your worth, maggot. I don't know how I'll go about doing that, but it probably involves a whole lot of killing. Oh, no! Oh, no, 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 no! Run, run, run! Oh, that hurt! Run! Okay, let's get out of here. Keep going. Oh, I see more houses down here. Let's go that way. <laughs> okay, that was not fun. We gotta really be careful about that. Really careful. I'm seeing water. Perhaps it is time for me to ditch my armor. My fur armor, anyway. Orc draught. Speed attack. One minute. Okay. Rotten flesh. Pass. Pass, pass, pass. I have much better now. And in fact... Hold on a sec here. It may be a little bit cold, but... Oh, oh, that feels good. Water. And we'll take this, whatever it is. Take some of this stuff. Oh, swimming around. Ah, oh, I finally feel a little bit cleaner. Ah, oh, wow. That is nice. Follow our normal custom of borrowing everything inside it. No one here. Perfect. Apples. Raw venison. Cooked raw. Okay. Um, don't need that. Don't need the fur either. Oh, I was going to read this book. It's going to be my, my sort of nighttime story. Let's do that another time. Awesome. No. No, not awesome. <laughs> Look at the entire troop of trolls guarding this place. Maybe they heard, oh, oh god. Maybe they heard about me and my ways of, okay. Maybe they hired trolls to protect their belongings since I seem to borrow them all the time. Okay, hi. Hi, how are you? Just gonna come in and take a quick look and not take anything at all. Because there's nothing good. That is a, that's a lot of damage. Maybe I'll take that. The leather. I feel like it could be useful for something maybe. All right. Um, the sun is still high in the sky, and we're gonna go this way, because I don't want to die. What is that up there? What is that right there? That is kind of weird. What is that? Huh? <gasps> really? That is very weird. What is it? What's that? What did I just get? Copper treasure pile? Huh. I see what looks like a chest up there. Gold treasure pile? What have I found? Well, let's go check this out, and then we're gonna go check that chest. I can't even talk right now. Check that chest. Check that chest. Um, thick sold smith scroll. Plus four protection versus falling. I must... Of power. That is very cool too. I must be able to use these 
Maybe on my equipment to make it better? We'll have to experiment. What's in here? The Traveler's Tale Part 2. And two silver ingots. Not a huge amount, but better than nothing. What is it doing just sitting out here? Huh. Well, I am not going to be complaining in any way. We're just going to... Just pretend it's ours. <laughs> pretend it always was. Because it is now. Wow. Oh, there's another one down here, too. A swift Arnorian spear. It is very, very fast. Silver nuggets. Man, my inventory's getting full again. All right, hold on a sec. Let's ditch that. Let's take a look around, make sure no one's going to try and kill us for a second, and let's organize things. Looks like another small village here. We're going to stop and take a quick look. The sun is going down, and I want to try and keep going, so I'm probably not going to stop here. But uh, there, there are a lot of places to sleep at night in the in the Angmar here. So I'm not really going to worry about it too much. You guys were definitely having a party. Please don't bother me. Uh, I'll take the steel, I guess. Oh, cooked venison. Why not? Yep, need it. Need it, need it. More venison, iron, string, huh. Oh man, I have a whole lot of stuff now. A lot of which is probably not going to be useful to me and I'll probably have to get rid of quite a bit of it. Hi, hello lady, how are you? I mean, I... Warriors of great might such as yourself are welcome in these lands. Really? Am I welcome in your house? Because, you know... I wouldn't mind staying. At all, actually. Hefty Angmar sword. Sharp iron throwing axe. And a lucky crooked Angmar warhammer. No, pass. Why do you have a crooked warhammer? Can you tell me that? No? You don't know? Alright. Oh, mushroom. Man. You know. Not long ago... That was my only source of food. It's incredible how far I've come in such a short period of time, honestly. Trying to... Oh! I see what looks like another chest down there. There are several chests. Okay, let's take a look. <gasps> I found a Mordor helmet. Mordor helmet and gold? Well, I found... Oh! More treasure. Why is there just treasure? Oops. Why is there just treasure sitting around? Cooling Arnorian leggings. Cooling, huh? Oh boy. I am really getting full here. Let's put this stuff away. Let's put that away as well. That'll just clear me out enough that I can get this. I also found some money. Oh, sorry. I mean, it's just sitting around, so you probably don't care, right? Okay, it's definitely nighttime. The sun is setting. We're going to try and keep on going. Find somewhere to stay for the night. Night has fallen over the land, but I have yet to find shelter, and I am still going. Oh, goodness. Trolls again. Keep on running. I figure I can make my journey a little bit more productive, and if I travel, the longer I travel, the better it is. So I figure until I find somewhere safe, I'm not going to stop, because I don't really want to sleep out in the open. And I don't really want to sleep in a tent either. What is that? Nah, nothing. It's very late at night. There are trolls everywhere, but I am still going, looking for, okay, a safe way through, and hoping that I can find some shelter. I see something up here. Oh my goodness, there are a lot of people here, and there's trolls throwing things at me. But I definitely do see a village. That is awesome. You can stay here for tonight really are a lot of trolls. My goodness. They're everywhere. All right, yeah, so we can definitely stay here and... Ah, ah. Long have I walked these halls. Searching. Waiting. How 
is it that you have left this place? I will find you. Brother! Thanks for watching this episode of Torment. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to show your support by giving me a like or sharing this video with your friends. Whatever you can do, I will appreciate very much. There are also a lot of other Lord of the Rings Minecraft videos on my channel. You can check them out as well. And as always, to be continued.